Did you know that between six and eight million cats and dogs wind up in shelters every year in this country and more than half of them end up being euthanized? A Boston-based group called the Last Hope Canine Rescue is working to lower those numbers. Reporter Sharon Johnson visited their tent at the Somerville Pet Palooza on August 2nd. She learned what makes rescue dogs and all dogs so special to so many people. We are Last Hope Canine Rescue. We are out of Boston. We are completely foster run. We don't have a shelter. Um, we're all also volunteer run. Everything we do is all volunteer. No one gets paid. So all the donations we get and all the fundraising we do goes all to the dogs. What's your dog's name? This is Susie. Susie's a happy little Westie. I rescued about uh, four and a half years ago. She's I rescued her when she was nine, so she's on, she's going to be 14. And uh, she came with the coat. <laughs> Um, so Coco um, is about four years old and Yoko is about two. Um, they're both rescue dogs. Um, we got Coco when we were living in, in Washington, D.C. and then Yoko when we moved here. Well, this is Kusa. Um, she comes from Arkansas. Um, she had a litter of puppies when she was there and they, they put her in the shelter, um, Just I think just because they couldn't take care of her anymore. Um, and we, I'm not sure how we picked her up, but we did, and I'm very glad we did. I spend a lot of time with her, and she makes me very happy. Yes, they're surrogate children, that's exactly right. When you think about all the dogs that go into shelters and they're put down simply because there isn't enough space for them, it's, it's awful, you know? I think every animal deserves a chance at knowing what love is and knowing what a home is and feeling like they're part of a pack and part of a family, and I think that's why we do what we do, and that's why it's so important.